All right, what we got here is the uh, grill off of the Dodge RV. And uh, if you can't see it, it's got a lot of wear, uh, worn down spots. Um, these are totally cracked, these lenses. But I found that these, they charged me about 150 bucks for these lenses, if you can find them. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use clear epoxy and patch these. So I've unscrewed them and I pulled them out, as you can see here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to give this a, uh, a base coat of uh, aluminum spray paint, metallic, and uh, try to freshen up this grill a little bit. So uh, stick with me and uh, we're going to see what happens with this. Alright. So we've got the the grill up here and we're going to put it on this side. You can see it's pretty bad. I'm going to try to give it a quick spritz. There we go. Just a light coating. Just going to go over it once or twice just to give it a Good coat there. And I'm going to do the light bezels as well so they match the headlight bezels. So it's kind of tired of the way some of these old grills look after they've been in the sun so long. So let's see how this turns out as we uh, spray it up here. I'm trying to get a good even coat. It's cool tonight. Hopefully the paint won't set up too quick. There we go. There we go. Better move these out of the way so I don't overspray these too. And get them over here. I am going to spray the inside of these. Um, because I think they need better reflectivity. So we're going to try that as well. As you can see, as you start to spray, the black on the inside gets covered up a little bit. I don't think that's necessarily a bad thing. It's really the damage from the sun that's created all these problems. So hopefully with the spraying of the aluminum coating that'll help correct that. There we go. And I think we have a pretty Nice, nicely done RV grill here. I'll just do real quickly some of the some of the lighter side here. It looks a little faded, but not too much because I don't want to get rid of the black on the underside. So I'm just touching it up in that corners where I think I can really get good coverage. There we go. And I think the, uh, the end result is pretty cool. Nice freshened up grill. More later.